Hi, welcome to the mini story for the conversation, Parents. Let's get started with the story. Freddy the Frog lives in the country of Frogland. When he was growing up, his father ran a tight ship. He made Freddy practice jumping 10 hours every day. Freddy was always tired, so he could not pay attention in school. Sometimes he couldn't even tell what day it was. I'm telling you, I just want to chase flies with my friends, Freddy said to his dad. Then his dad said, it's my way or the highway. His dad always told him that he would be a jumping champion. Sure enough, when he was 18 years old, he became the jumping champion of his country. Now Freddy is 55 years old. He thinks about his dad a lot. Now he knows that there was method to his dad's madness. Okay, so that's the end of our story. Now I will go back and read the story again, and this time I will ask questions as I read it. And you can answer the questions out loud. And if you need a little more time to answer the questions, then feel free to pause your iPod or your computer or whatever you're playing the lesson on. And then play it again when you have had enough time to think about the question. And of course, if you just feel like listening, well, that's okay too. Okay, let's start. Freddy the Frog lives in the country of Frogland. Does Freddy the Frog live in the country of Frogland? Yes, he does. Freddy the Frog lives in the country of Frogland. Who lives in Frogland? Freddy the Frog. Freddy the Frog lives in Frogland. Does Freddy the Frog or Mary the Lamb live in Frogland? Freddy the Frog. Freddy the Frog lives in Frogland. What type of animal is Freddy? A frog. Freddy is a frog. Is Freddy a frog or a rabbit? A frog. Freddy is a frog. He's not a rabbit. Where does Freddy live? In Frogland. Freddy lives in Frogland. Does Freddy live in Canada or Frogland? Frogland. Freddy lives in Frogland. Does Freddy live in Canada? No, Freddy doesn't live in Canada. Does Freddy live in Frogland? Yes, he does. Freddy lives in Frogland. What is Frogland? Is Frogland a country? Yes, it is. Frogland is a country. It is the country where Freddy the Frog lives. Freddy the Frog lives in the country of Frogland. When he was growing up, his father ran a tight ship. Did his father run a tight ship when he was growing up? Yes, he did. His father ran a tight ship when he was growing up. What did his father do? He ran a tight ship. His father ran a tight ship. Did his father run a race or run a tight ship? He ran a tight ship. He did not run a race. Did his father own a boat? 
No, his father did not own a boat. Did his father run a tight ship? Yes, he did. His father ran a tight ship. Was his father strict? Yes, yes he was. He ran a tight ship, which is the same as saying he was strict. To run a tight ship means to be strict. Did his father control what he did? Yes, he did. His father ran a tight ship, which is the same thing as saying his father was controlling or that he controlled what he did. So, his father ran a tight ship, which is the same as saying his father was strict, or you could say his father was controlling, his father controlled what he did. This is all the same thing. Who ran a tight ship? His father. His father ran a tight ship. Did his mother or his father run a tight ship? His father. His father ran a tight ship. Whose father ran a tight ship? Freddy's. Freddy's father ran a tight ship. Did Freddy's father run a tight ship? Yes, he did. Freddy's father ran a tight ship. Was Freddy's father strict? Yes, Freddy's father was strict. Freddy's father ran a tight ship. Did Freddy's father control what Freddy did? Yes, he did. His father ran a tight ship. His father was controlling. His father was strict. These all mean the same thing. When did his father run a tight ship? When he was growing up. When Freddy was growing up, his father ran a tight ship. Did his father run a tight ship when Freddy was growing up? Yes, he did. He ran a tight ship when Freddy was growing up. Did his father run a tight ship when Freddy was an adult? No, it was when he was growing up, not when he was an adult. Did his father run a tight ship when Freddy was a child? Yes, when Freddy was a child, his father ran a tight ship. Or you could say when Freddy was growing up his father ran a tight ship. It's the same thing. When you were talking about growing up, you're talking about the time when you were a child. Was his father strict when Freddy was a child? Yes, he was. He ran a tight ship when Freddy was growing up, which is the same thing as saying his father was strict when he was a child. He made Freddy practice jumping 10 hours every day. Did he make Freddy practice jumping 10 hours every day? Yes, he did. He made Freddy practice jumping 10 hours every day. What did he make Freddy do? Practice jumping. He made Freddy practice jumping. Did he make Freddy practice jumping or clean the house? Practice jumping. He made Freddy practice jumping. Who made Freddy practice jumping? His dad. His dad made him practice jumping. Did Freddy's Uncle Kenny make him practice jumping? 
No, it wasn't his Uncle Kenny. Did Freddy's dad make him practice jumping? Yes, he did. Freddy's dad made him practice jumping. Who had to practice? Freddy. Freddy had to practice. His dad made him practice. Did Freddy or his father have to practice? Freddy did. Freddy had to practice. His father made him practice. Did Freddy have to practice? Yes, he did. Freddy had to practice. His father made him practice. What did Freddy have to practice? Jumping. He had to practice jumping. Did Freddy have to practice playing the guitar or jumping? Jumping. He had to practice jumping. How much time did Freddy have to practice? Ten hours. He had to practice ten hours. Did he have to practice for ten hours or seven minutes? Ten hours. He had to practice for ten hours. How many hours did he practice? Ten. He practiced for ten hours. Did he practice for six or ten hours? Ten. He practiced for ten hours. How often did he practice? Every day. He had to practice every day. Did he only practice on Tuesdays? No, he practiced more than just on Tuesdays. Did he practice every day? Yes, he did. He practiced every day. Did Freddy's dad make him practice jumping every day? Yes, he did. His dad made him practice jumping every day. Freddy was always tired. Was Freddy always tired? Yes, he was. Freddy was always tired. Who was tired? Freddy. Freddy was tired. Was Freddy or his father tired? Freddy. Freddy was tired. Was Freddy happy? No, he wasn't happy. Was Freddy tired only sometimes? No, he wasn't tired only sometimes. He was tired more than that. Was Freddy always tired? Yes, he was. Freddy was always tired. Why was Freddy always tired? Well, it was because his father made him practice jumping for ten hours every day. That's why he was tired. So he could not pay attention in school. Could Freddy pay attention in school? No, he could not pay attention in school. What was Freddy unable to do? Pay attention in school. He could not pay attention in school. Was Freddy unable to eat lunch or pay attention 
in school. Pay attention. He was unable to pay attention in school. Was Freddie able to listen in school? No. No, he wasn't. He was not able to pay attention in school, which is the same thing as saying he was unable to listen in school. To pay attention means to listen to. Who could not pay attention in school? Freddie. Freddie could not pay attention in school. Was it Freddie or his sister? who was unable to pay attention in school. Freddy. It was Freddy. Freddy could not pay attention in school. Was Freddy unable to listen to his school teachers? Yes. Yes, we can say that. Because he could not pay attention in school. So he was unable to listen to his school teachers. Why was Freddy unable to pay attention in school? Well, because he was too tired, that's why. Sometimes he couldn't even tell what day it was. Could he tell what day it was? Well, sometimes he could not tell what day it was, so... Yeah, sometimes he could tell what day it was, but not always. Who couldn't tell what day it was? Freddy. Freddy couldn't even tell what day it was. Did Freddy know what day it was? Well, sometimes he did, but sometimes he did not know what day it was. If you say that you couldn't even tell what day it was, that's the same thing as saying you didn't even know what day it was. Did Freddy ever know what day it was? Well, yes. It was only sometimes that he could not tell what day it was, which means that sometimes he did not know what day it was. So sometimes he did know what day it was, but other times he did not know. I'm telling you, I just want to chase flies with my friends, Freddy said to his dad. Did Freddy tell his dad he just wanted to chase flies? Yes, he did. He said, I just want to chase flies. Was Freddy joking? No. No, he was not joking. When he said to his dad, I'm telling you, that means that he was not joking. I'm telling you means I'm serious. I'm not joking. Was Freddy serious? Yes, he was. He said, I'm telling you, which means I'm serious, or it means I'm not joking. What did Freddy want to do? Well, he wanted to chase flies with his friends. Did Freddy want to go to school or chase flies? He wanted to chase flies. Who wanted to chase flies? Freddy. Freddy wanted to chase flies. Did Freddy's dad want to chase flies? No, it wasn't Freddy's dad. Did Freddy want to chase flies? Yes, he did. Freddy wanted to chase flies. What did Freddy want to chase? Flies. He wanted to chase flies. Did he want to chase cars? or flies. Flies. He wanted to chase flies. 
he didn't want to chase cars. Was Freddy joking when he said he wanted to chase flies? No, he was not. He said, I'm telling you, I just want to chase flies. Which is the same thing as saying, I'm not joking, I want to chase flies. Or, I am serious, I want to chase flies. Did Freddy really want to chase flies? Well, yes, he did. He said he was serious, or he was not joking, and that he wanted to chase flies. So I guess he really did want to chase flies. Who did Freddy want to chase flies with? His friends. He wanted to chase flies with his friends. Did he want to chase flies with his dad? No, he did not want to chase flies with his dad. Did Freddy tell his dad he was serious? Yes, he did. He said, I'm telling you, which means I'm serious. Did Freddy tell his dad that he was not joking? Yes, he did. He said, I'm telling you, which means I'm not joking. Then his dad said, it's my way or the highway. Did his dad say, it's my way or the highway? Yes, he did. That's what his dad said. His dad said, it's my way or the highway. What did his dad say? Well, he said, it's my way or the highway. Did his dad tell Freddy that he had to do what he said? Well, yes, he told him, it's my way or the highway, which means he was telling Freddy that he had to do what he said. Did his dad tell him to do as he told him, or leave? Yes, he did. His dad told him, it's my way or the highway, which is the same thing as saying that he had to do what his father told him, or he had to leave. When someone says my way or the highway, it means you have to do what I'm saying or you have to leave. Who said it's my way or the highway? Freddy's dad. Freddy's dad said it. Did Freddy say it's my way or the highway? No, Freddy didn't say it. Did Freddy's dad say, it's my way or the highway? Yes, he did. It was Freddy's dad who said, it's my way or the highway. Who was his dad talking to? Well, he was talking to Freddy. Was he talking to Freddy or Freddy's mom? Freddy. He was talking to Freddy. Did Freddy's dad say that he had to leave if he did not do what he said? Yes, he did. Freddy's dad said, it's my way or the highway, which is the same thing as saying Freddy's dad said that Freddy had to do what he said or he had to leave. His dad always told him that he would be a jumping champion. Did his dad always tell him that he would be a jumping champion? Yes, he did. His dad always told him that he would be a jumping champion. What did his dad tell him? Well, he told him that he would be a jumping champion. Did his dad tell him that he would be the best jumper? Well, yeah, that's correct. He said he would be a jumping champion, 
And if you're a jumping champion, that means that you must be the best jumper. Who told him that he would be a jumping champion? His dad. His dad told him that he would be a jumping champion. Did Freddy's dad tell him that he would be a jumping champion? Yes, he did. Freddy's dad told him that he would be a jumping champion. Who would be a jumping champion? Would Freddy or his father be a jumping champion? Freddy. Freddy would be a jumping champion. What would Freddy be? Would he be a football player or a jumping champion? A jumping champion. Freddy would be a jumping champion. Sure enough, when he was 18 years old, he became the jumping champion of his country. Did he become the jumping champion of his country? When he was 18 years old? Yes, he did. He became the jumping champion of his country when he was 18 years old. Did he become the champion sure enough? Yes, sure enough, he became the champion. Did he become the champion as expected? Yes, he did. He became the champion sure enough, which is the same thing as saying he became the champion as expected. Sure enough means as expected. Was it expected that he would become the champion? Yes, it was. Sure enough, he would become the champion. Which is the same thing as saying it was expected that he would become the champion. Was it believed that he would become the champion? Yes, it was. Sure enough, he would become champion. Or it was believed that he would become the champion. Who became the jumping champion? Freddy. Freddy became the jumping champion. Did Freddy or his father become the jumping champion? Freddy did. Freddy became the jumping champion. What did Freddy become? Did he become the jumping champion? Yes, he did. He became the jumping champion. Did he become the jumping champion of his country? Yes, he did. He became the jumping champion of his country. What country did he become the jumping champion of? Did he become the jumping champion of France? No, it wasn't France. Did he become the jumping champion of Frogland? Yes, he did. He became the jumping champion of Frogland. When did he become the jumping champion? When he was 18 years old. When he was 18 years old, he became the jumping champion. How old was he when he became the jumping champion? 18 years old. He was 18 years old when he became the jumping champion. Was he 16 or 18 years old? 18. He was 18 years old. Did Freddy become the champion sure enough? 
Yes, he did. Sure enough, Freddy became the champion. Did Freddy become the champion as expected? Yes, he did. He became the champion sure enough, which is the same thing as saying he became the champion as expected. Sure enough means as expected. Now, Freddy is 55 years old. Is Freddy now 55 years old? Yes, he is. Freddy is now 55 years old. Who is now 55 years old? Freddy. Freddy is now 55 years old. Is Kenny or Freddy now 55 years old? Freddy. Freddy is now 55 years old. How old is Freddy? 55 years old. Freddy is 55 years old. Is he 55 years old or 25 months old? 55 years old. Freddy is 55 years old. How many years old is Freddy? 55. He is 55 years old. Is he 55 or 63 years old? 55. He's 55 years old now. Was he 55 years old three years ago? No, he's 55 years old now. He thinks about his dad a lot. Does he think about his dad a lot? Yes, he does. He thinks about his dad a lot. What does he do? He thinks about his dad a lot. Does he race cars or think about his dad a lot? He thinks about his dad a lot. He doesn't race cars. Who thinks about his dad a lot? Freddy. Freddy thinks about his dad a lot. Does Roger the Rabbit think about his dad a lot? No, not Roger the Rabbit. Does Freddy the Frog think about his dad a lot? Yes, he does. Freddy the Frog thinks about his dad a lot. Who does he think about? His dad. He thinks about his dad. Does he think about his mother? Or his father? His father. He thinks about his father a lot. Does he think about his father just a little? No. He thinks about his father more than just a little. Does he think about his father a lot? Yes, he does. He thinks about his father a lot. Now he knows there was method to his dad's madness. Does he now know that there was method to his dad's madness? Yes, he does. He now knows there was method to his dad's madness. What does he know? Well, he knows that there was method to his dad's madness. When he was younger, was Freddy able to understand why his father made him practice every day? 
No. No, he was not able to understand why his father made him practice every day. Does Freddy now know why his father made him practice every day? Yes, now he knows. He knows that there was method to his dad's madness, which means he now understands why his dad made him practice every day. Who knows that there was method to his dad's madness? Freddy. Freddy knows that there was method to his dad's madness. Does Freddy or his mother now know that there was method to his dad's madness? Freddy. Freddy now knows that there was method to his dad's madness. Does Freddy now know that there was method to his dad's madness? Yes, he does. Freddy now knows that there was method to his dad's madness. Does Freddy now understand why his dad made him practice jumping? Yes, he does. He understands now. He knows that there was method to his dad's madness. So he didn't understand back then why his father made him practice jumping, but now he does. Okay, so we are now at the end of the story, which means that we are at the end of the mini story lesson for the conversation parents. Now it's your turn to tell this story on your own. Remember that you do not need to memorize every word in the story, but that you do need to use the vocabulary words and idioms that we discussed. Those are growing up, ran a tight ship, pay attention, couldn't even tell, I'm telling you, my way or the highway, sure enough, method to his madness. Okay, so good luck telling the story, and remember, you can listen to this lesson as many times as you need to. Okay, see you next time. Hi, this is Kristen Dodds. And this is Joe Weiss. And we just wanted to let you know that this material has been copyrighted in the year 2008 by Learn Real English, LLC. www.learnrealenglish.com